What's popping, ladies and gentlemen? It's your man, Just Jay Sama. Uh, please forgive the fact that I didn't clean my room. I got really, really sleepy last night, and um, yeah, I tore the place apart. So <laughs> nobody wants to hear about your bed, you idiot. As you guys can tell from the title or whatever, I wanted to talk about Dragon Ball Fighters today. Um, as you guys know, I'm an avid, avid, like Dragon Ball fan. I guess I would say. Um, Maybe not, like, to the extreme that some other people are, but, uh, either way, huge fan of Dragon Ball, huge fan of Dragon Ball Fighters. The only problem is, I'm bad at the game. Like, I, I remember when it first came out, my first couple of matches playing in, um, a couple of discords and stuff, and I would just throw hands with the boys, but... Sure enough, I didn't realize that this game was more like Marvel 3 than it is Street Fighter. So I was like, oh, okay, I think I got this in the bag. No, 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 that's not, that's not what this is, that's not what this game is at all. As a unseasoned player, uh, I would get very, very triggered at the fact that people would just not let me play. And that was one of the things I really didn't like when I was playing in the Marvel era was literally somebody would juggle you into a combo and never put you down at that point i would just throw the controller and i'd be like i, I didn't realize i came here to not play the video game like that's that's not fun that has never been fun for me it's fun when you're winning i fucking get you you piece of shit when you're on the receiving end it's it's not so great not so great at all so today i wanted to take a look at the season three trailer for fighters and really make a decision if i want to get back into the game or not um i know there's been tons and tons of controversial changes like in season one i i can't even say season one because there's so many like patches of like seasons and stuff i remember like early on like obviously my favorite character in dragon ball history is beerus and unfortunately Beerus is like a bottom tier character now, which I don't know what that means when it comes to like the rest of the roster. Apparently Jiren's really bad too, um, so I'll probably have to take a look at that because I'm really curious about like what makes a character bad in comparison to like, I, I, I don't know, I'm sure somebody's going to tell me. Oh, let me actually turn the volume down because uh, of reasons. So it looks like they're going with the Universal Tournament uh which i think is great um this looks like it's gonna be a dramatic finish with goku and frieza so i'm i'm really really excited and hyped about that all of this stuff oh shit hold on i missed the best part excuse me Blah! okay cool um so all of this stuff that they're getting ready to put into the game you know there's gonna be maybe a couple other universal characters saga characters that would be really nice if we got like champa okay so we got ultra instinct goku which i i bet dope that's cool um i'm very that's that's hype but uh i would have really liked to see him with the black hair i think it's called like sign or something like that it's a it's ultra instinct sign or something um but this works for me too um i would have loved for him to go the white hair and his like level three that would have been really cool um a lot of the stuff in fighters when you do the level three it takes you into like a transformation or something like that um i haven't played the game in in god knows how long like years at this point uh so i don't really know who does what i know broly um dragon ball super broly when he does his level three his armor comes off so i think that's a really cool touch and then let's see i think we also got so these moves bro like these moves are pretty slick i don't know what what pose this is but this is it's a little strange and he goes bah, okay uh and jiren's face oh my god wow i wonder if every character makes that type of expression okay so is this like a dot first of all that was the uh, ultimate amount of swagger hold on uh let's go frame by frame the best we can oh we didn't went too far oh he is doing something nasty okay hold on let's see uh, everything's buffering today and this is really really irritating so this is like a smooth dodge like i didn't even see it so he had obviously he has a bunch of dodge moves and then this is probably a counter um I, i'm not even gonna pretend like i know but okay here we go transform oh and he loses the fit he loses the, the whole shirt gotta come off wow and then this is the ultimate hype moment when kefla comes out so it's like oh okay that's dope now for the fighter stuff, I would love to see, I would absolutely love to see, so we have Kefla, hold on, actually, I, I don't really want to pay attention to her moveset, except for her butt cheeks, but that's about it. 
I really did not like this character at first, but I think because she's just so silly, she reminds me so much of Vegito, like, and how she kind of just screws around with a lot of stuff. She's overexpressive. That's why I really, really like this character. So, you know, it took her a while to grow on me just because it feels like it's mostly Khalifa. Like, she just seems like a really dope character. And if you guys can't tell, uh, there's only certain things that I, I can and can't speak on because I, um, I kind of care, but kind of don't care. Oh, what is this? Her level, level one? And then this is her level three? Oh, that's pretty slick. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's, that's interesting. So Kefla is now in the game. Um, that's, it's pretty hype. I'm excited about that. Um, and then this finisher screen, uh, yes, yes, ladies. So now with the Fighters 3, uh, Fighters Pass 3, I'm, I'm really, really expecting maybe one more Universal Saga character and then two GT characters. Uh, that would be really hype. I want to see Master Roshi. I feel like Master Roshi would be a great addition to the game. Um, obviously we're probably going to see either Shenron or Super 17, um, because we don't have any GT villains. So that will be very interesting. And I remember when I made my video about Videl before she came out, I was like, yeah, there's a high chance Videl is going to be in the game because she's a hand-to-hand -hand combat character and that's what this game needs. And then people were like, oh no, she'll never be in the game. And then poof, next thing you know, she gets released with Jiren. So, um, I'm very, very excited to see who else we get. We already have Android 17 in the game. Matter of fact, hold on, let's do this. We're going to close this. And then let's see, universal. This is all. This is all Dokkan, of course. <laughs> but uh, yeah, maybe we'll get. Uh, I don't know some universe six characters. Bergamo would be really cool if we got Bergamo in the game. Um, that would be really dope. Uh, Skinny Majin Buu would be kind of cool. Um, although we already we already have Fat Buu in the game, so we, we don't really don't really need that. Maybe we'll get Topo, maybe we'll get Dispo, maybe we'll get Dispo and Topo. That'll be really cool. What are we, what are we doing here? What 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 am I Googling right now? That's what I want to know. What am I Googling? But yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing a bunch of new characters. Uh, I wonder if there's going to be a season four. Maybe it's a little too early to ask about that, but I, I don't really know. I'm somebody who's like very, very hyped. I don't see myself getting this game yet. I, I still don't see myself buying it only because let's actually let's pull it up hold on let's see how much the game is all right so let's just go ahead and look at the price here uh select a retailer this is playstation store i want it on pc obviously because you know uh and then this has like multiple editions so i don't even know what any of these are about so fighters pass doesn't even where's the price <laughs> where's the i want to see the price i want to see the price baby this is digital edition digital ultimate edition but buy now select a retailer game gamestop gamestop ah no 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 so i also have this amazon link open apparently it's 19.99 so that's a sale right now so that's cool but what about all these dlc packs though like i want i want like everything all together how how do i get that how is is there a way i can like purchase all of the dlc all at one time because otherwise it's not really it's not really worth it to me like i want uh, hold on switch ps4 xbox one well, i can't buy it on pc it must be on steam now i gotta wait for steam to load great <laughs> this is gonna take 20 years all right so apparently on steam this game is not on sale it's fucking 59.99 and then there's a fighters z edi fighters edition that's a hundred dollars a hundred and nine dollars bro i don't i don't know about this i uh, uh what why is this game so expensive <laughs> i don't understand when did this game come out 2018 this game's two years old and it's still 59.99 what do these get they think this is a nintendo game then you can buy the characters individually for 4.99 a piece really i only want broly gogeta janimba nah i'm good yeah sure let me get him uh and then the fighters pass fighters pass 2 it comes with jiren videl uh just Jiren and Videl apparently. I assume Gogeta uh Broly. Um so I assume it's these six. Not base Goku. Um uh, not Bardock because I think he's part of Fighters Pass 1. Yeah, you know, this is uh this is interesting. So 
I don't really see myself getting this. Ooh, look at the drip on this boy. I don't really see myself getting this game uh, until there's like a definitive edition or something that's not a hundred fucking dollars. Um, so you can miss me with this shit, but you know, for 20 bucks on the PS4, I don't really play. I I only play on PC, so. But let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Uh, your thoughts, your opinions, your concerns, anything that you may have, let me know down there. Um, are any of you guys active players in the fighters community, I guess? Um, and if so, what is your favorite part of the game? Maybe you guys can help convince me that I should actually pay for it because <laughs> I'm not I'm not likely to do that anytime soon. But I'm, I'm very interested, so let me know down in the comment section. Uh, this has been your man, Jay Sama, and I'll see you you guys next time make sure to keep it canon <laughs>